we just did a sprout shopping trip. There you guys have Seventy-seven dollars. Uh, I'm gonna show you guys what we got really fast, and I'm just gonna do a review for you guys. We bought the Arctic Zeros. I've been seeing them everywhere, so I had to try them. Buttery pecan. Um, we got a little bit chippy ice cream, and of course we had to get the chocolate chip cookie dough. sure I don't even really need to do a review on this one but um blueberry pancake syrup eat up my syrup but that's pretty damn good for blueberry pancake syrup thumbs up that's it's pretty good actually hell yeah I would eat that every day I'm not even gonna review this one because everyone knows that Walden Farms pancake syrup is fucking delicious good Oh, that smells delicious. Let's see. It tastes sugar free, but it tastes really good. Take another teaspoon. I would buy it again. Heck yeah. It just tastes really light, like really light strawberries. If that makes any sense. Like not covered in like sugar like you usually have when you have strawberry syrups. It's really good. It's like refreshingly good if that makes any sense. The chocolate syrup again. I've already had this one before. Um, so I don't feel like if I did a review it would be like an honest reaction. It's pretty good. Um, it, without the sugar it obviously doesn't taste like as heavenly rich. Hershey's chocolate. Like Hershey's chocolate. Exactly. It doesn't taste like Hershey's chocolate. I would say if you're cutting, then it's perfect because um, you can mix it with like protein or like um, peanut butter, things like that. It has a bit of a different taste to it. It's really good. This is like the fifth one that we've bought and we always buy it when we run out. Um, but yeah, I'm not going to try that one just because I've had it. Alden Farms Strawberry Jelly. Um, this one, of course. It's actually not as watery. Oh, wow. It's, look at, it's like. It's le like legit jelly. Does that make any sense? I thought it would be more watery. It smells like Smucker's sugar free jelly syrup. Oh. Weird. It has it has like a jello consistency. Like it's almost slipped right down my throat. Let me try it again. I didn't even like really taste it. it didn't taste bad. It tastes like um jello. It tastes it doesn't really shake too much. Yeah. It's good. I would buy it again, honestly. It tastes better than Smucker's sugar free um syrup because I have Smucker's sugar free syrup and it tastes like crap and I never eat it because it's freaking nasty. Smucker's, not a fan, it's freaking gross. Seriously. Do you see how full this is? I'm going to show you this one in like two weeks and it'll be halfway gone. Anyways, still a good review. I mean, if you don't mind a jello consistency, but when it's on toast, it's not going to be jello consistency. Anyways, I'm looking forward to trying this one. I'm wondering what's in this. So it is marshmallow spread, marshmallow dip, um, zero. Oh, fucking smell. Let me smell it. That smells like marshmallows. Right? Uh, kind of. No, it does. Hold on. Have you ever smelled marshmallow whip? I don't remember. Oh, okay, well. <clears throat> it smells really good. Marshmallow whippy consistency. Let me try it one more time. On like a scale of one to five, I 
probably give it like a two. Mm. And it's not bad, and, and I'll probably eat it with my dessert tonight. I'm not going to try that one yet. So I'm going to go ahead and try this one. The best one, the most exciting one. Ah, oh, I've been waiting. I almost, we actually opened the top in the car. And then I decided, well, that's not right. Because if I try it in the car, then when I do a review for you guys, it's going to be fake. And you're not going to get my honest opinion. Goopy, yeah, it's not thick. You know how, like, natural peanut butter is not thick? So you kind of reach to the bottom. All right, I'm kind of nervous. horrible job you can make other things taste so wonderful i mean i guess if it was amazing then other people would be eating it right all right randomly not sweet or anything but alfredo sauce um i ordered quest pasta which i'll be getting this week and i'll do a review on the quest pasta um and the protein that i got from quest as well but um calorie free alfredo. i love alfredo sauce and i'm sure the seasonings it's just super watery Oh yeah, pretty good. I mean, for sugar-free Alfredo sauce, it's not thick like normal Alfredo sauce, but that would taste damn good on your pasta. I'll definitely smother my Quest pasta in this processed Alfredo sauce. That's the Italian Walden Farms. Little Just tiny the bit. Yeah, it tastes like zesty Italian sauce. It's good. If you like love salad dressing, which I don't, I prefer to put lemons and salt on mine. If I use a dressing, it's going to be ranch, which I won't buy. Sugar-free is gross. Um, so that's good. That's perfectly fine. Ice cream. It's chunky. Nice and chunky. Sounds delicious. What's the macros on here? Half a cup. There's four servings. Nine carbs. 2.5 fat. 105 sodium. Three grams of protein and six grams of sugar. 75 calories for one serving. There we go. All right. High hopes for this. Dude, li you want to know how it tastes? Like freaking buttery pecans. <laughs> that's okay. I, I don't even need another bite. I'm about it's to have lactose free. That's really cool. This is really cool for lactose intolerant people. Anyways, a little bit chippy. Um, say it has 11 carbs, 1.5 fat, and 3 grams of protein. Um, also for half a cup, they're all for half a cup, so. Still 11 carbs, one fat on the top. Let's find a piece of chocolate. I have high hopes for this, please don't let me down. Mmm. It tastes like, uh, you can see there's like chocolate pieces. Ooh, ooh, the chocolate bits actually taste really good. Okay. Well, I say... One, I'm not a big vanilla ice cream fan, so I actually, it obviously is a little bit chippy, but I thought it was going to be chocolate base. Um, the vanilla tastes like a sugar-free vanilla ice cream, but the chocolate pieces are like a rich Hershey's milk chocolate, so those taste really good. So that's another really good one, actually. Not bad. No. I'm just not a vanilla. Also in vanilla ice cream, so hopefully it tastes good. Fit frozen desserts. Okay. So, 12 carbs, 1.5 fat, and 3 protein. Good. 8 grams. That's good. That is, this is what I'm having tonight. It doesn't need chocolate chips. 
that's real cookie dough. That tastes freaking good. Oh my god, that's good. I don't even know if the ice cream is good though. I mean, it's vanilla ice cream. Doesn't matter. Just dig out all the cookie dough. Does the macros change if you like put all the cookie dough in one bowl and eat that with half a serving of ice cream? No, babe. The same. Um, 36 cal. This is probably the best one. 36 calories for half a cup. Seven carbs, three protein, no fat. That's, That's fat. No, it does not. Oh, it doesn't. Do fat. That's crazy good. This has to be. This is like the old one, babe. Yeah, it's the older one. So it's not going to taste as good. It's not going to taste as good. Even though we just made up in our minds that they revamped them. It's bad after. It tastes like the orange creamsicles. <laughs> <laughs> Leg seriously, it's pretty legit. Heck yeah. That's good. It's obviously missing some sugar, but it tastes like orange creamsicles. Okay. Right, take it away.